Roderick. Welcome to High Point. Thank you. Lord. You're not nervous, are you? Uh, are you? I could ask you the same thing. All these soldiers. I wasn't the one who invited the Glenmores. Father, please. Can we just get on with this? Well. All right, let's sit. a keep for the gods. What stonework, he said. What craftsmanship. He wouldn't stop talking about it. Well, it's nice. If you ask me, I'd say he was envious. My point is very impressive. It is. Compared to your pile of timber. Alright, that's mean, man. Where's Ryan? Always worried about your family, aren't you? Of course. What? Let's toast to family! Won't you toast with me, Roderick? To family. To family. To, to family. family. Tell us why we're here, or let's talk business. Now, as lovely as this is, I presume we have business to discuss. Indeed we do. The Ironwood business is thriving, Roderick. In fact, the Boltons want weapons faster than we can make them. And when Roose Bolton wants something, I like to give it. Sounds like you need us. So, in other words, you need our help. <laughs> Don't be so damn full of yourself. You foresters are headed for destruction. Yet, you know more about Ironwood than any house in the realm. Would be a shame for all that knowledge to be lost. Help me craft ironwood for the Boltons, and I'll make sure you foresters survive. That's absurd. If you think you can threaten I'm us. I'm not threatening. So you're proposing an alliance? An alliance? I said nothing of the sort. Oh boy. He'd make us his slaves. Roderick, this could save your house. I'd consider an alliance. You see what I have to put up with. Just give him time. I told you. I offer you peace. And you spit at it. I offer opportunity. And you demand more. Can we just kill I him right here now? Coming since you refuse to kiss my ring. Here's how it's gonna go, Roderick. Either you agree to my terms. Or I'll have Griff tear Iron Wrath to the ground. He'll put it to the torch. This isn't the way to They're get what you want. They begin slaughtering your small folk. Funny you should mention Griff. Have you heard from him lately? What are you getting at? He's locked in our darkest cellar along with your entire fucking garrison. You didn't. Yeah, we you did. You imprisoned my son. He was there by order of the Warden of the North. You miscalculated, Lord. Now you'll pay the price. If you want Griff back, my brother returns home. We want Ryan back, and we want him today. Oh, uh, what's he, what's he going to do? He's probably he's angry. It's Ryan. Ryan. He's going to kill him, probably. I, I thought you'd forgotten about them. Yeah, I was, I was scared this would happen. Mine. Let him go. He's not going anywhere. Listen to her. Don't do I swear this. by the gods if you hurt. Let him go, or I'll have Griff This is killed. not what we agreed. Grim him, not me. If you want to see Griff alive again, you think I give two shits about Griff? Oh boy, that's that's not good. Kill me! Oh, we all die! Don't you 
Call his bluff. I'll kill you. Go on then. Do it. What? You think I won't? I know you won't. Don't test him, Roderick. Just for all your bluster, all your posturing, you care about your son. Yeah, he does. Whitey. He's still a white. Yeah. You know what, Roderick? You're right. <laughs> You idiot. No. We'll make the trade on neutral soil. Griff for Ryan. A son for a son. Fine. Now, get the fuck out of my hall. And the gods have mercy on us both when the Boltons come for their ironwood. It's been a pleasure. <laughs> been a pleasure promoting. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Roderick. I am from ice. He'll be okay, I'm sure. I don't really care about him anyway, because he's just a little kid and we barely know him anyway, so it would be okay if he were to pass away somehow there it is I, I could live with it now listen up none of those guards can live long enough to light that beacon because if they do this invasion gets a whole lot fucking harder don't drop that that's cool what a fancy thing all right so we can look at the guards here the entrance We'll need to take those two out first. Well, yeah, clearly we we will. Uh, we got a hut. How many men do you think are in there? Hard to know for sure. At least five, maybe more. To answer your question, too many to fight head on. All right, fair enough. And then we got this thing, the beacon. Is that a harpy? Of course it is. Those golden tits are everywhere in this bloody city. If those guards light the rope, the fire travels up to the bowl, and the whole city will know we're here. So we stop them. Hi. Come on, let's get moving. Alright, we it's not like we actually have any plan right now, so that's that's no good. Best go. Hmm. It's nothing. Just forget yeah, it. Yeah, she's probably not very happy with me. Forget about your master. I know Dizor didn't go the way you wanted, but now is not the time for regret. You knew what it meant to me, Asha, and you were Yeah, it's done now. I'll take him. I've got the other one. How are they not seeing us? I don't need him to watch me. Hey, prove it. We are right what? behind them. Just sit outside the gates waiting. Mother of dragons. She wants to scare us. But she won't do it. That's how we do it. Alright, that's two down. Like ten to go, maybe. We'll split up. One group will go high and try to climb over to the other side. What about them? That's why someone needs to stay down here. They get behind cover and shoot the men up top. Oh, I want to shoot them. Let that one see you. So, which will it be? I, I want to be uh, stay below his crossbow. Yeah. We'll stay on the ground. You take the wall. I just want to shoot crossbows. Here we go, round the boxes. We'll have to take care of him first. Oh boy. 
he'll see you. I know that. All right, can I just stab him already? Don't worry, buddy. He's gonna turn around right now. Oh, maybe, maybe not. Apparently not. Look at those crossbows. I'm gonna shoot the one on the left. What? He just looked at him. And uh, did nothing. What an idiot. He could have lit the beacon, but no. Well, he's still gonna mess it up, probably. Oh boy. What happened? Not important. Keep moving. Quick, the guards on the roof. Yeah, if he dies from that, we're gonna be in You'll trouble. Yeah, that's that's a great idea. They're not gonna be gonna be able to move a barrel, which you can move just by yourself. Pretty easily. I mean. Alright. No 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 no. It's too much. What? It's too much, you'll ruin it. I know what I mean. Where am I going? I'm gonna kill that guy, I guess. I'm, I'm not sure why that was important, but it seemed like a good idea. Alright, guide down. Nice going. Alright, can we just, uh, can we just kill this guy? <laughs> that made no sense at all. Well, we got him, though. They're still up there. On the right. Take them out, and you'll be clear to secure the beacon. They break through. I'll keep them busy. Yeah, he's gonna, he's gonna die. I imagine. We can finish this. Just look at them. Two men. We've dealt with worse. Let's rush them and be done with it. But there's still guys up there, yeah. You afraid of a couple of crossbows? We took on the lost legion by us. No, we're gonna stick to the plan here. This is nothing. We stick to Groff's plan. Take care of them first. All right. Don't be an idiot. Don't act all cool, RK. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta be smart here. What's up, buddy? No scoped. All right, that's one down. Only one left. Oh, that's that's not good. Hey, get this! Oh shit! All right, so maybe rushing would have been a better, a better idea. Die. What did I just... I don't know what I just did, but apparently I killed that guy. Close to win, though. That's good. Well, hello. Oh, that guy's dead. Oh, I didn't move. Oh, I should have moved. Well, you know... I messed that up. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, let's try that again. Do not light the beacon, man. Alright. He says, well, hello there. Well, hello. 
No, you don't. Stop him. No, you idiot. Cut the fuse. Okay, then. You just kill him? Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna grab the axe. That's what I'm gonna do. Grab that. And I'm gonna I'm gonna kill that guy's ass. That's what, I, that's what I'm gonna do. Oh, we're gonna break that now? How's that a plan? Just kill the dude. That was very dangerous, and I could have killed Beshka. So how about Croft? He was he was all alone over there. <laughs> oh, I can't believe you did. I mean, he's probably dead. Croft! Croft! Quit your whimpering. I'm not dead yet. Yay. Why not though? Hear that? Someone probably messed up though. Or maybe not. It's starting. Well, we did good. We did we did a good job there. I'm proud of us, the son of winter. And here we go, back to uh Iron Wrath. Home at last. Back at High Point, I wasn't sure your brother would survive the day. He nearly didn't. I was terrified when you called Lud's bluff, but you knew exactly what you were doing. Of course I did. And now Ryan will be coming home. He'll sleep in his bed. Eat at our table. Don't celebrate yet. He'll be right here, where he belongs. We'll celebrate once Ryan has returned safely. We still need to make the trade. You're right, of course. Still, you did well today. Don't lose sight of that. My lord, look! Yeah, something's probably probably wrong here. There's nobody here. Where are the gods? Who is it? Some Wyhill dudes, or the Boltons, maybe? Or the traitor? Dahlia? Oh, did she die because of me now? Sir Ryland! Where's my sister? Elena! Where's anybody? <laughs> is it... Who is that? Right here. Either... Maybe Griff broke out, but I don't really see that being a feasible option here. Must be the Boltons, probably. <laughs> Come on. Yep. Oh boy. Maybe you think you can do better. Of course not. I I didn't mean to That's a song instead. I hear you've written a touching song about your dead brother. What is going on in here? Let's hear it, shall we? No. No. Roderick! Roderick! Welcome back. State your business. State your business now. I thought you'd have more courtesy. I do not. Especially after getting to know your sister. We've had a lovely time together. Haven't we, Tavia? Say it. Say it's been lovely. It's been lovely. At least she's not rude. I'm told you're a man who can't be broken. I've decided to come see for myself. Am I gonna fight him? Or are they just gonna end it here on this giant cliffhanger? Yep, that's what I was thinking. That's fun. Thank you, Telltale.
Ethan was the first forester I killed. Doesn't have to be the last. You don't know what you're in for, Garrett. What you're asking my brother to do. The North Grove isn't what you think it is. You claim to be a leader, yet your own people do not respect you. But we did as you commanded! These aren't cell swords, Asher. They're killers. Roderick! I can't believe I trusted him. I know you were my brother in contact. Perhaps he told you things. Things that might prove his guilt. Perhaps you're not to be trusted either. Oh, you're not listening, Garrett. Shh. White Walkers. All right, that was fun. Oh my God, look at me. Look at me go. All right, so basically everybody brought Finn along. Uh, not everybody showed mercy to Griff. Not everybody. Pretty much no one revealed Sarah's secret, so that's plus one for me. I, I, that was fun. I enjoyed that very much. Um, most people actually ordered the soldiers to stay behind. So that's not our very unpopular choice. And uh, actually, most people allowed Bashka to kill the Slave Master. So I really only made one choice that was extremely popular. So this this should actually be pretty interesting, um, especially if someone out there is watching to see, you know, what people are doing. Uh, I guess that would mean that in this playthrough, you're probably going to see a lot of choices that most people would make, especially the one with revealing Sarah's secret. That was incredibly messed up, which is why I loved it so much. Uh, awesome. All right. Any other choices, maybe? Or, I guess that was basically it. All right, that's the credits. Um, all right. No, thank you. Leave me alone. I do not want that. All right, so that is the end of episode four. Uh, I actually very much enjoyed it, especially towards the ending. Uh, I, I didn't really like the first part that much. But I really enjoyed the parts uh, of King's Landing, obviously, and the, um, as always, the Iron Wrath story got pretty interesting. Uh, so that's pretty awesome, and I'm very curious to see where they're going to take things in Episode 5. I hope you guys enjoyed as well. If you did, please let me know and what you thought of my choices, <laughs> because I, I loved them, but I'm pretty sure there's going to be some people out there that, that will be angry, maybe, or they'll really understand them. But um, thanks for watching, guys. Again, hope you enjoyed, and I'll, I'll talk to you when the next episode is finally released. So probably sometime next year. Uh, thanks for watching, guys.